Hey everyone, Murakumo here and welcome to episode 1 of Road to the Top series, uh, Final Fantasy Edition. Basically my goal is to get to item level 470 before the next update hits. So let me show you all my gear. I currently have a 465 Hades weapon, 460 head, 460 body, 460 hands, 470 waist, uh, 450 legs, gotta fix that, 460 feet. And on the other side, I have 470 earrings, 470 necklace, 470 bracelets, 470 ring, well, two 470 rings. Basically, my goal is to get all of my gear to 470. Um, some of my 470 accessories came from the previous Hades raid, if you remember, Hades Resurrection. This is now Hades Descent, or my bad, sorry, Eden's Resurrection, and this is now uh, Eden's Descent. Uh, the second raid is a bit more difficult, so if you want to see me be a scrub in the learning process, feel free to do so. I'll try and walk you through some of the mechanics so you can understand, and also for myself, so I can try and learn from my mistakes. Um, I'm also doing this on Machinist, not on Gunbreaker, as I've done a lot of my previous videos just because the tank slots were already filled, so I was like, eh, I might as well do my next favorite class next. Shadow Flame is a tank buster, so gonna hit the tanks pretty hard. They have to cool down through that. Entropy is a room wide AoE. Healers just have to heal us, make sure we don't die. So the next mechanic is gonna be delayed the flares. We also have to move to the edge of the platform so as to not take that giant orange AoE as I just did brilliantly. Uh, so we're stacking here for the flares. Healers are going to be expected to heal through the flare damage and through the unholy darkness which is coming shortly after. Alright, here goes the first round of flares. Healers are going to have to heal us up really quickly after they explode because unholy darkness is counting down at the same time. There we go. We made it through that. Now we have another round of flares that are in waiting. Shadow Flame's gonna hit the two tanks. Okay. Up next. We have a spell in waiting eye, so everybody else has to turn away from us for this mechanic uh, when it does go off, otherwise they get turned to stone and I'm pretty sure you die from it. So the eyes are going to go off and I believe the flares are also going to go off. Yep, there we go. Flares went off, eyes went off, nobody got caught by the eyes. The next is dark fire 3, there we go. Now we have to match colors, uh, match a black with a white, we have predetermined partners. And then everybody has to stand in one of these puddles. If we don't, we take huge ray damage. Cleaver, everybody has to get in their predetermined spots. What's next? Shadow Flame is Tank Buster. So a tank should cool down for this. Actually messing up my machinist rotation a lot, so please don't judge me. I haven't played machinist in a very long time. Alright, quietus, so the bosses from here are gonna basically slow and rage so he gets stronger and stronger and hits us with more things until we die basically. Cycle of Retribution is a combo of moves that we've seen thus far so we have to move in and then we have to go to our spots and then we have to move out for the guillotine there we go yeah it's three moves back to back you have to be paying really close attention and you also have to memorize what order the moves are gonna go in. You see somebody saying they took a guillotine yep guillotine will for sure kill you uh, cycle of chaos so now another three set um, yeah you go to the sides for that first guillotine you go in for that slicer and then your predetermined spots for the cleaver 
So from here, our rate pretty much dies slowly, but um, just uploading this video so I can show you guys my progress. Um, this is my next raid to clear, and then I will get all of my gear for this on my Gunbreaker, which is my highest class currently. And then it will be on to Eden's Gate Inundation. Yeah. So stay tuned for the next Road to the Top. Hopefully I will be pa I will be past this raid and I will have better news for you all. See you all in my next video.